This is Jerry Obamoyi, uh, the watermelon man. Uh, this afternoon, I've uh, actually come to the farm to see what is happening here in the farm. As you can see right behind me here, this is just one of our of our farms, and um, this particular farm here is just about um, 35 days old. This farm was planted. Uh, I think on the 15th of September. All right. So what one thing I want to actually uh, make you understand from this uh, video this afternoon is that um, if you could see from this farm right here now, no, we we've been able to use the scientific approach of getting uh, getting rid of weeds to make sure that um, we eventually combat this uh, weed from depriving this melon from uh, from from moving you can see the way they are the way the the melons are actually growing now all right the weeds are still dying we use systemic uh chemicals in getting rid of this and uh, weed all right and then um, the beauty is that the farm is properly spaced and the melons are they are spreading they are covering Within the next 30 days, to make it 60 days, what you'll be seeing in this farm is, is going to be an absolute covering of this entire farm with the spreading of the branches as the vines of this watermelon. Alright, but before then, you see one or two melons trying to form into balls. Like one you are seeing right here. Now, I think there is one here already. This is just, this is barely, uh, barely 35 days now. This is how it's going to be like this one here is still germinating if you, if you look around you see the flowers are coming out already all right so that is how it's going to be before within this you could see you could see the flowers <laughs> so on this farm now it's as if nothing is happening you could also see from this place again now this is what we eventually form turn into what you buy from the watermelon and this as if nothing is happening right here in this farm but i can assure you that when next we come to this farm to do another video again you will see all of these small small uh watermelon and uh, fruits and it's trying to form into uh balls gaining bigger size and then um, the growth rate would increase all right so you could see from this farm we have not used anything like cutlass in this farm what happened what we've actually done here uh, uh, briefly is that the tractor came you could see the lines of the tractor the path of the tractor the tractor came and uh, the land was tilled and after tilling has been done we actually went ahead with our planting all right also on this farm we've not applied our solid fertilizers all that has just taken place here is just the liquid fertilizer which is the foliar fertilizer alongside with the treatment chemicals all right and uh, with all things all things being equal it will be like this within the next couple of days with all of these branches increasing then underneath it the balls which is the fruit will be developing so within the next 30 days to another 40 days actually as from the as from 70 days you start seeing some appreciable level of development so what we've been, what we've been able to do here is that we've ensured that um, during the course of planting there was spacing of the fruit you could see they were properly spaced and then um, the cover fleeting which is the scientific approach that we have developed in getting rid of weeds we are actually done where some of the weeds are still drying up and um, it's, a system, it's, it's a systemic stuff, so it does not have instant effect. That's how it's going to continue until the entire base within this watermelon farm would have dried up. All right, then the spreading will continue like this. Then the the flowering will also continue. For for now, you're just you're, you're barely seeing few flowers. All right, few flowers. Within the next couple of days now pollination would have start then there would have been uh, a complete um, presence of um, flowering 
thereafter, when it gets to, uh, I think, by the grace of God, by the first week of um, December, the last week of September to the first, second week of December, I'll be coming back again to do another video. Then you would have seen the magic. You know, for the now, it's as if something is happening. That's how it's like. The first few 30 days to 40 days, it's as if it's a child's play. All right. But as from the 50, the, 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 as from the 50 days, as from 50 days rather, to 60 days, you begin to see uh, absolute um, uh, appreciation of what's, what is happening right here. All right, this is just a segment of this farm. We have, I think in three, we have about uh, three sessions of this farm. All right, three sessions. Then they were planted in badges so as to afford those opportunity to have, to, to, to have them um, uh, produce into the market at different uh, pace of time. All right, so that's just for it for this video. For those who don't actually have an idea of what is happening, this size is like, all right, you could see it from the background here. This is a standard um, a watermelon farm that will be making us uh, our expected amount of money at the end of uh, 75 days. All right, thank you so much for watching.